Hello, and welcome to our Serenade video. In this video, we will show you how to sign your forms in the client portal. Before we begin, please take time reading the email sent to you by your caseworker, giving you instructions about the forms. It should also include a link to the client portal. Let us log into the client portal. If you do not remember your login credentials, you can use the screen here to help remind you of your username and password. Additionally, you may contact your caseworker and ask them to provide you credentials. Let us proceed logging in. Once inside the client portal, you will see you have items in your inbox. Let us click on Inbox. From the inbox, you will see different forms listed. You will click the Open button to take you into the form. We are now inside the form. You can review the form going page by page. On the black toolbar up top, you have tools to help you navigate through the form. You have the options of going to the next page, previous page, last page, and first page. Once you've reviewed the form, you will go to the area to sign, typically found on the last pages of the form. You will then see a button that says sign here. Click on it. By doing so, it will open a signature box where you have a couple options. The first option is you can upload an image of a signature. If going this route, you will click Choose File, where it will ask you to locate the image of your signature in the device you are using. If using Draw It, you can use your mouse to sign your name, or use your finger or stylus if using a touchscreen device, such as a cell phone or tablet. Lastly, you can type out your name. By going this route, the software will create a signature based on what you typed. You have the option of selecting different styles here. Once you have signed in the form, either uploading, drawing it, or typing it, you will finalize by clicking Update Signature. Your form has now been signed. Below the signature area, you will type out the date you signed this form. Once you have signed and dated the form, you can now submit this back to the caseworker. To do so, you will go to the black toolbar up top and click the Submit button. You will then get a pop-up letting you know that the form has been submitted successfully. Your caseworker will be alerted that the form has now been submitted. If you have more forms to sign, you can repeat the process of signing the forms using the steps explained previously on this video. This concludes our video on signing forms in the client portal. Thank you for watching.